I found Zara, but before I could get him out of there, Rice ambushed us. I'm not sure what Rice has planned for us, but whatever it is, I'm sure it's not gonna be pleasant. Stand him up. Oh shit. Dark. You come to us like a snake in the grass. Here, in a city of lies, you are the biggest liar of them all. Who are you talking about? Answer me, motherfucker! Yes, lose control. That is what you Americans are so good at, after all. Corpses. Leave, Craig. Yes, sir.
fear will spread. Such a shame you'll be a corpse by then. Is this your first feeble attempt at controlling your own destiny, Crane? Too little, too late, I fear. Impressive! For a walking dead man.
You have provided some quality entertainment for my men. Too bad it's a one-time performance. This will only prolong the inevitable. But try to make the best of it, huh? Let no one say I never gave you anything, Crane. Your skills no longer come as a surprise, Crane. The GRE selects its operatives well. <sighs> Shit. Lower the platform. Otherwise, is the sheerest folly. Allow me to demonstrate. Hassan, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Publish the file. Right away, sir. And there, it is the You just doomed thousands of innocent people! That's what you get with your fucking chaos! You don't know what was on that file, do you, Craig? You only prove my point for me. The GRE plans to weaponize the virus, not cure it. They're only interested in profit, not saving lives. And by following their rules, you have become their trained monkey. Pathetic. All right. Kill him. Get you out of here. Crane, save these people. They don't deserve all of this. You, give me that torch. <laughs> Crane! What are you swine waiting for? Shoot him! I'm sorry, Doc.
I found a way out of the arena. Now I gotta haul ass back to Brecken. But Zara, he didn't make it. He said he gave his research to Jade before Rice grabbed him, so there might still be a shred of hope for a cure. No, not now. to hide you at the pier. Half of Rice's men are after you. Whatever you've done, it's really put them on the warpath. I have to talk to Jade. Zara, he gave her his research. She took it to Camden, or she tried to. Camden radioed that Rice's thugs had found his lab. So he flooded it with biters and barricaded himself in the middle. Now he's trapped. Then the connection failed. We haven't been able to raise him since. I'm going after her. How was she getting in? That part of town is sealed off. There's a group called the Saviors that smuggles people through. They have a den at Nico's bar in the cauldron near the highway. The contact's name is Cenk. Do, do you have enough runners to cover airdrops? The airdrops stopped 36 hours ago. There won't be any more. We're out of time, Crane. Shit. All right. I don't know if I can fix this, but I'm sure it's all gonna try. You know... Most men in your situation will crawl into a hole and hide. Hats off to you, mate, and good luck. Hey, Crane, here's your gear. Best regards from Kareem. <laughs> Kareem, huh? Uh, if you see him, thank him for me.
And this is Fatin. Stop eating termites off that stick and get here immediately. Was that simple enough? Yes, but you are holding down the talk button. And who told you you could use my radio? The same person who told you you could eat my sandwich. You were supposed to make lunch for both of us! Crane, one more thing, mate. Do you remember that girl from Sector Zero, Troy? Yeah, she called to thank me after I got the antenna towers working. You should contact her when you get there. Well, good idea. Thanks, Brecken. Right. You take care. You found some crayons! Oh, fantastic. You're the best. The kids are gonna lose their minds. But in a good way. Here, take this. You'll make better use of it than I will. Finally. I was getting worried you weren't coming. You keep pumping red smoke in the air, you're gonna have all kinds of visitors. Red's all I had left. Anyway, you're here, so it did the job. Give this envelope to Aziz at the bazaar. Tell him it's from Ryan. Red phosphorus, lye, iodine, muriatic acid, diethyl ether, phenyl nitrate. Geez, not exactly Grandma's recipe for Christmas cookies. Lena, this is Crane. Are you there? Crane, it's a man. Lena's tied up. Can I help you? Someone just gave me a grocery list with red phosphorus, lye, iodine, muriatic acid, diethyl ether, and phenyl nitrate. Ah, then someone just gave you a recipe for cooking slam. Rice's crews have been using it to stay up for days at a time. Volatiles are more reasonable than someone tanked up on that stuff. Well, maybe I should put this guy out of business. Actually, we're pretty desperate for phenyl nitrate. It's a lab grape disinfectant, and we're completely out of it. Well, you want me to pick up his shopping list? Definitely. Then find me at the tower. I've got an idea that should throw a monkey wrench into the operation. You was ease? Ryan sent me. What happened to Assam? What do you think? You guys take a lot of chances out there. Look. I've got everything but the phenyl nitrate. And you don't have what I need, and that's not gonna cut it with Ryan. What can I do? The courier wrecked his car in the tunnel last night. He's with Assam now, and your phenyl nitrate is stuck in the trunk of his car. You wanted to go get it. Cause there's no more in Haran. That's the last phenyl nitrate anyone's going to be seeing. What's his car look like? Hmm. White, I think. That's all I remember, white car. So you're really going to do this? Ryan doesn't like to be disappointed. You must be pretty tough. If you don't die doing this thing, I just might have an opportunity for you. Fennel nitrate. Oh, fantastic. Bring it here.
Hey, open up in there. Who are you? Crane, from the tower. I heard a woman screaming. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's my wife. She's, a uh, she's giving birth. Oh, shit. Is there anything I can do? We need alcohol. To disinfect. Please, help us. Alcohol? Uh. Yeah, I've got some alcohol. Thank you. Oh, this is gonna be a big help. But, uh, is that all you could find? It's not really enough. I'd go out myself, but I can't leave my wife now. Let me see if I can find some more. Hey, it's Crane. I found some more. Yeah! Great, because we're going through it like water. But, ah, oh, is that it? It's almost enough, but not quite. You must have a lot of germs in there. Oh, with this terrible plague, everything has to be clean. Spotless. I can't risk my newborn getting infected. We must have more alcohol. The diseases actually transfer from a bite that causes... Hey, I've got the alcohol. Everything okay in there? Oh, you got some more? Uh, yeah, here. Oh, cheers. Bye. I could let it go, but I don't think I'm going to. Drink my granny sauce down to the ground, down to the ground, down to the ground. Of course. Sell our slippers or galoshes and the Drink away, drink away, drink away. We'll sell our granny sauce to buy more booze. Kill you. Good to see you again, Mr. Uh, what's his name? Crane, like the mindless machine that lifts heavy things. Just tell me what you need and I'll be on my way. <sighs> duct tape. Uh, cables. We need ten rolls of duct tape. No, we need ten power cables. Duct tape. Cables! Duct tape. Cables! Duct tape! Look, I get it. You need both. Precisely. Precisely. And that concludes talking to you. Get going! Ten rolls of duct tape, ten cables. You've done well, Simeon. You are performing far beyond your capabilities. Of course, they say to improve your game, you should play with someone better than yourself. Clearly, contact with Tolga and I has significantly increased your intelligence. So, you are welcome. <sighs> One more task and we will be done. What do you need? There is a military base on the other side of the Collapse Bridge. You will zip line across to it. Using the borrowed intelligence we have imbued you with, you will find a military-grade mobile sonar unit. Bring it to us. Bring it to us. Mr. Dahl will want to see you as well, so please, use some deodorant and try not to drool on yourself so much. All right, get going. Crane, Watching you is far painful. Here. Is About that moss growing on you again? We've got Stop an idea moving. how to improve it. Maybe he'll move Drop it by as soon as you can. General relativity okay. states that all things are in motion, but somehow you are not. Harun, you monster! What's the matter? That brute Harun threw my sister Ida out of the village. She's a widow with two children, Yasmina and Jamil. They snuck under the fence to go after their mother. Yasmina came back yesterday, but Aida and Jamil are still out there. Please, can you find my sister and nephew and bring them back? I'll do what I can. Where's the girl? In my house. She's hiding from Harun. She thinks he'll throw her out too. Maybe I'll talk to Harun.
He's not here. Oh. Well, you'd better go find him. I'm looking for Harun. Harun? If a toothache was a man, it would be Harun. If you see him, could you push him into a hole? Yes, Mina? Hey, I want to help your mom. Can you talk to me? Your mom's in danger. I need to find her. She's gone. She was beaten. Harun says you can't be here once you've been beaten. I'm going to get her to a place that has medicine. They won't make her leave. Now, can you tell me what happened to you and your brother? Me and Jamil went under the fence to find our mom. It took a while, but we found her at the houses behind the tunnel. Only there was a biter there. He beat me, and my mom hit him on the head. You were bitten? Only a little. I tried to get away. What did your mom do? She put us in a house, and then she went to look for medicine. When she came back, she told Jamil to wait there, and then she took me to the man. Did he give you medicine? Yes. He said we would both need more, but that me and my mom could stay in his basement as his puppets. I don't know what he meant, but my mom got scared and hit him and told me to run. So I did. It's all right, Yasmina. I'll find her. Where does the man live? I'm not sure. It's a house with hammers and, and axes. And where's your brother? Jamil is hiding in the house with the red flowers. You're a brave girl, Yasmina, but I need you to stay here a little longer, okay? And keep away from Harun until I get back. Can you do that? You're really going to find my brother and mom? Yeah, you bet I will. Thank you, mister. I need to find Harun. Nobody likes Harun, but if you ask me, he's the only one who knows what needs to be done. Where can I find Harun? Yeah, most likely he's under the bridge. That is where most of the are. before everything collapsed. Can't you see I'm busy? Why'd you force that woman to leave the village? You mean Ida? She's infected. All infected gotta go outside. Is that Gersel's rule? Some people don't want to make the tough calls around here. Well, I did. If Ida didn't want to get thrown out, she shouldn't have let herself get bit. Tough luck. <laughs> Bad break. What about her kids? What about them? There's no answers in around here. I was doing them a favor so they wouldn't have to watch us hacking up their mum when she turns into a fucking monster. I'm starting not to like you. Hey, I'm not looking for trouble. You seem like a good guy. Have a nice day, okay? Now go fuck yourself.
Take it easy, take it easy, I won't hurt you. You're Jamil, right? Y yes Okay, I'm looking for your mom. Can you tell me where she is? Yasmina was bitten by one of those creatures. So mom took her to a man that found a medicine that fell from the sky. She said his name was Salim. Do you know where Salim lives? In the tool shop. All right, now listen to me, Jamil. I'm going to go get your mom and come back for you. So you wait right here, okay? Okay, just come back soon. All right, we will, don't worry. Salim! Salim, we need to talk! Go away! I'm armed, so you better get the hell out of here. You have to let Ida go! You mean that stupid woman? She's dead. She was infected, so I had to kill her. Now, her daughter says you have antizin. I don't know anything about this. It has nothing to do with me. Salim, I'm not leaving without her. Oh, yeah? So you want to have a party? How about I invite some more guests?
hunt down her children and feed them to the volatiles. Ow! You're just making me mad! Done to you. Take it easy, take it easy, you're free. Yes, Mina, my daughter. She went. She's safe, she's back at the village. Your son's still hiding at the house where you left him. What am I going to do? We can't stay in the village. Haruno will throw us out again. You're going to take your kids and go to the tower. I want you to find a doctor there named Lena. Tell her that Crane says to take care of you, and that he'll make sure there's enough antizin for you and your daughter. You are Crane? Yeah, yeah, I'm Crane. Now go back to Jamil, he's waiting for you. Yasmina's with your sister. Thank you for being kind to me. I didn't think there was any kindness left.
Tolga, it's Crane. I have your sonar unit. Sonar? Oh, we don't need that now. Who told you we needed it now? Where did you get this idea? Get off my radio, Fatin! Uh, just let me know when you need it. Crane out. He's not going to think so when I get done with him. I've got a better idea. Bring him this instead. It's the Alavon, a sleeping aid. Let him cook up a batch with that in it. It'll send Rice's goons off to Dreamland. I don't think Rice will like that. Hmm, <laughs> probably not, but they could use this sleep. And there's no more fennel nitrate, so I guess he's out of business either way. And I like your thinking, Aman. to burn alive? Just give us the stuff! Who's this it's idiot? It's not worth time! He's a dead idiot! Kill him! I'm getting tired of asking nicely! Ryan, it's me. I got your stuff. Open up. Oh, thanks. They were just about to torch this place. Who were those guys? Competitors. There's no more fennel nitrate left in Haran, so they were hoping I'd got my last order. Here's something a little extra for coming through for me. Guess this is gonna be my last batch. Pleasure doing business with you. you know, take some advice. After you finish your deal with Rice, don't you go somewhere else. Don't stay here. Way ahead of you, pal. Yeah, no, I don't think you are. 